Hello ladies and gentlemen, those in between, welcome back to my YouTube channel, my name is Everett and today we are going to be reacting to CJ Opiaz's full performance at Miss Grand International 2024 National Costume Competition. Oh my gosh. An emblem of a champion. The Anahao, a symbol of Filipino strength, resilience, and victory, represents valor and hard work. This costume inspired by oh my the gosh. Anahao, embodies the spirit of the Filipino people, crafted with thousands of golden crystals. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my goodness. Ah. Yes, queen. Yes. Yes, queen. That's it. Okay, wait. First of all, guys, to those of you who live outside the Philippines, um, Anahao is the national leaf of our country here in the Philippines. And this national costume is an Anahao inspired one. And guys, the last time I was super excited about Miss Grand International was when Samantha Bernardo represented the country. And I honestly thought she would snatch the crown at that time because Come on, let's face it, she truly deserved to have been crowned. But unfortunately, someone else had been crowned. Now, um, why am I filming this reaction video? First off, this is just my little way of supporting our representative, CJ Opiaza. I know, if I'm not mistaken, at the moment she's not feeling well because I saw one video clip earlier today where there was this one person that gave her, like, medicine for her to take and i love the way cj um interacts with the fans and of course to her supporters um she seems to be very very friendly and the fact that she didn't have enough time to prepare for the competition is one um evidence that she is really trying to put up a good fight for the philippines as a beauty pageant enthusiast myself, I no longer hope that the Philippines will win in this competition because, as we all know, for so long the Philippines has been deprived of its um, well-deserved victory, if you guys know what I mean. But this time, win or lose, I am giving my full support to CJ Piazza because like I said, she makes me feel as excited as I was back when Samantha Bernardo represented the Philippines in Miss Grand International. I saw her swimsuit um, performance. I think that was more like their preliminary swimsuit competition and oh my goodness, I couldn't help screaming out loud. I couldn't help screaming in top of my lungs i was like whoa yeah I, I just couldn't help going whoa and this and that freaking wow just wow um and in fact let me tell you just a little bit of story uh real quick i actually had a bardagulan like um more like an argument with a basher online which i don't normally do but this time i don't know what happened to me but I really had that intense argument with that person who uh, bashed CJ Piazza to death because I was like, how dare you say some negative things about her performance during the swimsuit competition when in fact, she actually gave her absolute best. And here's the thing, 
so many Thai fans and even foreign fans are in love with CJ. I mean, how can we Filipinos not support her? You know what I mean? But anyway, um, I just hope that she really takes good care of her health just before the final competition, just so that she can really raise the flag of the Philippines with so much pride. And of course, you know, um, well, like I said, I'm not really hoping her to win, but come on, guys. It's pretty much obvious. She is giving us, she is putting up a, a good fight. And the way she projects um, on that stage, the way she carried that national costume. And before filming this reaction video, I actually read like an article saying something along the lines of her national costume was really heavy. And to think that she is not in a good physical condition, the fact that she was able to carry herself so, oh my goodness, so magnificently, she did such an absolutely amazing performance. And she looks gorgeous. And she looks good. And at now inspired like green national costume um she she's definitely glowing up and um by the way anahao is also often planted as an ornamental for both indoor and outdoor Just, i mean to those of you who have no idea of this but anyway we might as well re-watch this video right from the very beginning again because I still can't get enough of this, but maybe after filming this reaction video, I will be um, re-watching this, I don't know, maybe a hundred more times. Because <laughs> I honestly can't count how many times I watched her um, full performance the swims, uh, at the swimsuit competition. Goodness gracious, she did absolutely amazing. Let's do it again in three, two, one, let's go. Coffee. I don't know about you guys, but I'm very, very proud of our representative this year. She doesn't even look like she is struggling with carrying that heavy national costume. Love the way she projects right in front of the camera. She really knows what her best angles at, angles at, and. The details of that national costume are insane. The color combination of her national costume, green, silver, um, a little bit of blue in the back. No, no. Uh, yeah, maybe. On the sleeves. More like navy blue. I, I, I can't recognize what color exactly that is. I mean, whoa. Hello. Ito na naman tayo, aasa naman tayo. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I'm just super proud of her. I mean, she truly deserved to have chosen to represent the country. Ah. Aww. <laughs> okay, guys. I might as well wrap this video up by saying first off i'd like to apologize that i had to keep the size of this video this small because i'm not 100 percent confident about using the official video for this reaction video due to copyright issues second of all i completely understand that so many of us have been frustrated by the fact that um, the philippines should have won in the previous um you know edition of miss grand international but come on guys i personally can't help super excited this time i don't know why but there's something about cj that has sparked my interest off and i here i am again like patiently waiting for the coronation night to see what will take place and um win or lose i just I just want to give my full support to our beloved representative. I mean, can you guys imagine being in her situation like three days after her being crowned as Miss Grand International, no, Miss Grand Philippines, she flew to Thailand to 
uh, to 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 start engaging in all of these activities, right? I mean, wow, she is truly the one. At sana nga, sana nga. But then again, not really. Ah, I'm here up on my side, guys. <laughs> uh, but I just love the way she answered uh, when she was asked what she thought of Filipinos saying that Miss Grand International was a cooking show. You guys saw the interview, I'm sure. But anyway, please um, let's support our fellow Kababayan, CJ Opiaza, because she's really doing her best to represent our country with so much pride and of course um, in such an excellent manner okay so win or lose Filipinas tayo so that's about it for today's video thank you so much for watching this video and if you like this video hit the like button hit subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you can be notified when my next video comes out peace out <laughs>